Hi students, this video is about double integration sketching the region. Here we are starting with a double, integration, double integral and we are trying to picture the region that we are going to integrate. The following integral uh, gives an area of the region in the xy plane. So the region is, the question is integral 0 to 1 of integral 0 to x of f of x comma y dy dx. So here is it just uh, our integrand is f of x comma y and we just have dy dx only. So it means that uh, we are basically looking at the 2D region. So we can sketch this region in xy plane. So let's move on to this. Yeah. So first of all, we have to take the limits of the question. So here the limit that is integral 0 to x is given for the variable uh, y and the integral 0 to 1 is given for the in variable x. So 0 to x is the limit for y and 0 to 1 is the limit for x. So we have to take the limits first. The given limit you take it and write first. y is equal to 0, y is equal to x and x equal to 0 and x is equal to 1. So now let's move on to draw the graph. So first of all what are the limits? y is equal to 0 y is equal to x, x is equal to 0 and x is equal to 1. These are the limits given. So let's move on to the uh, graph by taking the x-axis and y-axis. Then immediately you put the uh, equations of these two. Equation of x-axis is y is equal to 0. Equation of y-axis, x is equal to 0. I just mentioned like this. Then we are uh, taking this limit that is y is equal to x. This line is nothing but the line passes through the origin that is y is equal to x this line represents y is equal to x so according to y limit y limits varies from where to where yes from 0 to x so to represent this y limit we can denote uh, we can draw lines from down to up direction that is from x axis that is y is equal to 0 to y is equal to x we can draw line like this so, okay, it's starting with the lower limit that is 0 to the upper limit x. So, we can draw the lines like this to represent the y region. So, according to y limit, we can draw the region like this. Okay. So, now let's move on to the uh, x limit. x limit varies from 0 to 1. So, x is equal to 0 is the line represents y axis that already we have denoted. Then, x is equal to 1 is a line nothing but x is equal to 1. So here we can uh, take this point is uh, x is equal to 1. Just assuming that uh, this is this point represents x is equal to 1. So we can draw a line. This line represents x is equal to 1. Just put the equations of this line. Uh, equation of this line x is equal to 1 nearby the line. Okay. So now we have drawn x is equal to 0 and x is equal to 1. So according to x limit we have to draw the region. So, according to y limit, we have drawn the region by vertical uh, lines. Then now we are going to represent the uh, region according to x limit by horizontal lines. Okay, so the lower limit is 0. So, from the line x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 1. So, we can represent it like uh, the according to the x limit, we can represent the region like this from x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 1. So, now you see both the lines are intersecting and only in the uh, inner the triangular part both lines are intersecting only in this part only in this triangular part so this is our required region you see both lines are intersecting only in this triangular part so this is our required region so just move on to the answer yeah this is the final answer fair graph so you see we have uh, just sketched the region and we have established that what the picture looks like regarding the given double integration. Okay, so this is our required region. Let's move to the another example. Take this question. Uh, draw the region of integration 0 to b integral 0 to a by b b minus y f of x comma y dx dy so first of all you take and write the limits so how will you take the limits x is equal to 0 to x is equal to a by b 
of b minus y so just we can multiply this that is b we can rewrite this as bx is equal to a b minus x y sorry a y so just you divide both sides by a b then you will get x by a plus y by b is equal to y by b is equal to 1 this is the equation of line of intercept form. This is the equation of line of intercept form. That is, it's this line uh, intersecting x-axis at the distance a and y-axis at the distance b. Then, uh, see the outer limit. Outer limit is given for uh, y limit, sorry, y variable. So, y varies from 0 to y varies from b. So, these are the limits. So, let's move on to the graph. So, x is equal to 0, uh, x by a plus y by b is equal to 1 is the a x limit and then y limit is given as y is equal to 0 y is equal to b so let's move on to the graph so just we can draw the uh, x-axis y-axis and another so just we can draw the x-axis and y-axis so you use scale and pencil to draw this, not like this. Okay. So x is equal to uh, 0. That means that using the x limit, we can take x is equal to 0 represents the uh, y-axis. And y, uh, y is equal to 0 represents the x-axis. So we can draw the line x by a. We can choose another color to draw this. X by A plus Y by B is equal to 1. So, I am taking this line. This is the line. So, this point is uh, A comma 0. This point represents 0 comma B. Okay. So, this line. This is the line X by A plus Y by B is equal to 1. So, now you see according to uh, X limit. Now, according to X limit, we are going to draw the region. So according to x limit, we have to take it from left to right direction from x is equal to 0 to this line, x by line of intercept form. From according to x limit, the region is going on like this. We have to take it from left to right direction. So it is going on like this. It's going. Okay. Then according to y limit, y limit varies from where to where? y is equal to 0 to y is equal to b. So how to draw the line y is equal to b? y is equal to 0. Already we have drawn. So y is equal to b how so this is the point b okay y is equal to b is the point this point so y is equal to b is the line which is passes through the uh, b that is which is passes through the y axis and which is parallel to the x axis this line represents this is a straight line uh, represents y is equal to b this line passes through y axis at the distance b and which is parallel to x axis so just we have drawn the y is equal to b. So now we are going to uh, mark the region according to the y axis. Sorry, y limit. So y limit varies from 0 to b. So according to y limit, the lim region is going on like this. Y from 0 to this line. From this line to this line is going on like this. So both lines are intersecting only in the triangular part. So, both lines are intersecting only in this triangular part. So, we can uh, note down like uh, this is our required region. This triangular region is our required region. Okay, this is the answer. Let's see one more example. Draw the region of integration 0 to 1 of 0 to, sorry, x2 root of 1 minus x square f of x comma y dy dx. So first of all, we can take and write the limits of the integration y limit, that is y varies from x2 root of 1 minus x square. So y is equal to x2 root of 1 minus x square is nothing but uh, this is the equation of circle which center at origin and radius 1. So, x square plus y square is equal to 1. This is the equation of a circle with center at origin and radius 1. Then outer limit you see, outer limit is given for x variable that is 0 to 1. Take and write a limit. x is equal to 0, x is equal to 1. So, let's move on to the graph. That is, uh, we can draw the x-axis and uh, 
this is this represents x axis and the equation of x axis y is equal to 0 and draw the y axis which is the equation of y axis is x is equal to 0. So first of all we can draw the circle x square plus y square is equal to 1 yeah, like this which uh, a center lies in the origin. So this is the circle with center at origin and radius 1. So this point is 1, the distance 1 and here also the distance 1. So next we can draw the line of y is equal to x. Yes, this is the line represents y is equal to x. So let's move on to draw the uh, y region. That is according to the y limit, what is the region? Just we can draw. So we can take the color to represent this. So according to uh, y limit, y varies from x to the circle. Okay, so from down to a direction, from this line to the circle, from this line to the circle, it's going on like this, up to the circle. From y is equal to x to y is equal to. So now what is our region? So now we have to check it out the x limit also. Then only we can finalize which is our required region. So according to x limit, x limit varies from 0 to 1. So 0 is the y axis. So y axis to x is equal to 1. How to draw the line x is equal to 1? So x is equal to 1 is the line uh, which lies in the, uh, which passes through the x axis at the distance 1 and which is parallel to the y axis. Actually, this is the line x is equal to 1. This line represents x is equal to 1. So, you see, according to the x limit, uh, we have to draw the region. So, uh, to represent the uh, x limit, we can draw the horizontal lines. So, uh, from this x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 1. From this to, from this line to this line. It's going on like this. It's going on. So, what is the required region? Both lines are intersecting only in the, which part? Yes, both lines are intersecting only in the, uh the region this only in this region both lines are intersecting only in this part so this is our required region so okay so like this we can find out our region this is our required region So this region is our equation. Thank you.